Hi, I'm Heidi Jackson. I'm a senior project manager here at Rural Sourcing, and I am passionate about working with agile teams. So Agile is a really powerful tool, but it's meant for small teams who self-manage. And oftentimes that's not the case that large organizations have small projects every single time. So they need to be able to scale Agile to work for them. Agile frameworks like Scrum and Kanban are going to let organizations deliver to the customer faster, but also adjust to the market faster. So if something changes, they don't have to wait a long time to make those changes. So there's a lot more predictability and they um, can manage their risk in smaller increments. You really want to make sure that you're realizing um, and bringing to market first a minimum viable product or an MVP. This lets you get feedback really fast. You learn fast. Some people like to say fail fast. I like to say learn fast because that's really what you're doing. You're able to find out if you've got the right product uh, features um, built uh, early on. And if you don't, you can change course quickly. You've got to do a single backlog. So a product backlog is basically a list of every task or requirement that has to be undertaken in order for the product to be built. If you're working from different product backlogs across different teams, nobody has the whole picture. So having a single product backlog is critical for product owners to really be able to manage transparency and show everyone there's a single source of truth. You have to build a collaborative culture. That's got to be part of your DNA. And so it really takes effort to transition to that kind of change. You have to be able to uh, build uh, opportunities for the teams to collaborate. Choosing the right large scale agile approach framework is really critical to your success. It's going to give your team members the right process and structure because scaled agile has many different flavors and you've got to choose the right one.